check whether the emergency off switch is released and switch on manpower switch and water pump switch for this experiment we have three setup first is single pump second is series configuration of two pumps and the third one is parallel configuration of two pumps fill something with the tap water by open flow adjustment valve v1 Connect the stop cock as shown in figure 1. If the handle parallel to the pipe, valve is open. And if the handle perpendicular to the pipe, valve is closed. Switch on pump 1 with the main switch on the switch box. And pump 2 must remain off. Adjust the outlet valve by setting pressure P to 0 bar in order to obtain the desired volumetric flow rate Q and record measured value in table 1. So you need to record the suction on the intake side of the pump, P delivery on the delivery side of the pump, and Q which is volumetric flow rate. In order to determine volumetric flow rate, close the drain valve, use stopwatch to establish time required for raising the level in the volumetric tank up to 10 liters. Repeat with the other 6 pressure, P equal to 0 0.5, 1, 1.5, 2.5 and 3 bar for series configuration of two pumps first connect the stop cock as shown in figure 2 switch on both pump 1 and pump 2 with the main switch on the switch box adjust the outlet valve by setting pressure P to 0 bar in order to obtain the desired volumetric flow rate record all measured values in table 2 so you will record P section 1 and P delivery 1 for pump 1 P section 2 and P delivery 2 for pump 2 and Q is volumetric flow rate in order to determine volumetric flow rate close the drain valve use stopwatch to establish time required for raising the level in the volumetric tank up to 10 liters for experiment 3 parallel configuration of two pumps connect the stop cock as shown in figure 3 switch on both pump 1 and pump 2 with the main switch on the switch box adjust the outlet valve by setting pressure P to 0 bar in order to obtain the desired volumetric flow rate Q. Record measured value into the table 3. So you will record P section 1 and P delivery 1 for pump 1, P section 2 and P delivery 2 for pump 2, and Q is volumetric flow rate. In order to determine volumetric flow rate, close the drain valve use stopwatch to establish time required for raising the level in the volumetric tank up to 10 liters plot the pump characteristic curve for each configuration it is advisable to plot all three curves single pump series configuration and parallel configuration in one graph and get the best fit curve for the graph on the vertical axis the pressure different delta p between the intake side and the delivery side is plotted so you can use the formula as stated in the lab manual for the horizontal axis is the respective volumetric flow rate q next is determine the total power p of the pump for each configuration by using p equal to delta p multiplied with q 